In today's video, I'm going to teach you how to change your name in FaceTime on your iPhone. A useful trick, especially if you want to personalize your experience or update outdated information. Let's break it down step by step to make sure you get it right without any hassle. First, we're going to tackle the caller ID. To start, you'll need to open the settings on your iPhone. From there, scroll through the menu to find and select apps. Within this section, locate FaceTime. Tap on it to open the FaceTime settings. Once you're in, scroll down until you reach the caller ID section. Here you have the option to choose which contact detail you'd like to use as your FaceTime caller ID. This could be your phone number, an email address or your Apple ID. Just select the one that suits your preference and that will be the ID people see when you call them using FaceTime. Should there ever be a time when you want to hide your number from appearing as a caller ID, there's a simple way to do that. Return to the main settings menu, then go to phone. From there you can find an option called show my caller ID. Simply toggle this option off to keep your number private when making calls. Now, if you're curious about changing your name on your Apple ID, which FaceTime can also display as you make calls, here's how it's done. Start by opening the settings app once again. At the top of the screen, you will notice your name displayed. Tap on it and it's going to open your Apple ID settings. From here, you'll see an edit button, usually located near the top right corner. Tap on it and you'll be able to update your full name along with other personal details. Once you're satisfied with your changes and everything looks good, don't forget to hit done to save your new information. This additional step of updating your name in Apple ID is optional, but can give a polished touch to how your information is presented during FaceTime calls. It's a great way to ensure consistency, especially if your name or professional details have changed over time. And there you have it, a complete overview of how to update your name in FaceTime. Whether you're changing the caller ID or updating your Apple ID name entirely, these simple steps have got you covered. Remember, keeping your digital identity current and reflective of who you are is always a smart move. Thanks for tuning in and I hope this guide was helpful. Don't forget to like and subscribe for more tips and tutorials.